Hey guys, it's me, Vanessa Fernandez, your Beachbody coach, and today I am answering your questions. And one of the questions that I get a lot is, how do you get your kids to eat healthy fruits? Now, please do not think, because I'm making this video, that my kids eat healthy all the time. They're normal kids, sometimes they don't want it, and that's just the reality of life. But uh, I have seen some amazing progress in my kids' diet, and the number one factor is my diet. Cleaning up my diet, leading by example, and not even, guys, I haven't even really told my kids that they need to eat healthier. All I've done is stopped buying junk. So if they ask me for it, we just don't have it in the house. And they see me eating really healthy stuff. When I'm hungry for a snack, I eat fruit. And so when they're hungry for a snack, they've started asking me for fruit. Uh, at lunch, almost every day, I have a salad. So they want to try some of it. And I let them. Even if all they want to try is like the good stuff, you know, like if I put craisins and almonds or if I put strawberries and, you know, some turkey, like maybe that's all they want are just the toppings. But I still am excited that they are looking onto my plate and seeing that example. I've heard this said over and over again, I'm sure you've heard it before, more is caught than taught. They catch more just from seeing us and what we're doing as their parents than they ever will from us trying to teach them, trying to, trying to change them and, and dictate to them what they should and shouldn't do. If you live it out, your kids are going to catch it. Um, so that is the number one thing I would say is focus on your own diet, focus on your own nutrition, keep unhealthy foods just out of the house altogether. And then what I do allow for my kids is if we're out and about, um, I'll get them an ice cream or I'll get them some fruit snacks or something. But it's, it's one of those treats. It's not a staple in our house by any means. Um, the second thing I do is I do require them to take at least one bite of everything. Now, this is getting into parenting styles and I don't wanna, you know, everybody has their own way. Um, not saying my way is better than yours, but you know, a lot of times my kids will realize once they eat one bite that it actually kind of tastes pretty good. And studies have shown that it takes 12 tastes of something before you can acquire a taste for it. And so maybe my kids aren't going to acquire a taste for Brussels sprouts right now, but if they eat one bite and then maybe a month later they eat one bite again, <laughs> maybe over the course of a year they've had 12 bites and their taste buds can actually become acclimated to that delicious Brussels sprout. Um, so don't give up after just one try is my second tip. Keep giving them healthy foods even if they only take one bite. That one bite is inching their taste buds closer to saying, hey, this actually tastes good. Hey, I actually like this. And the end goal, guys, is that we have adults who will actually eat vegetables. So maybe they're not going to be eating huge plates of Brussels sprouts when they're five years old, but if you continue to offer it to them, if you keep the junk food out of the house, and if you lead by example, you have a much, much better chance of your kids growing up healthy adults, loving good nutritious foods. So those are my tips for you. I hope that that was helpful. And um, comment below because I'm sure you have some great tips too, and I'm always looking for some great new ways to help my kids eat healthier. Thanks, guys.